All right, guys, here we go. It is Thursday, April the 29th, and this is what we cover for today. So for review, I asked the class this question. What does it mean when a customer's experience is seamless whenever they come across your brand? So seamless just means that there's no division. So if I come across the brand of Bath and Body Works in the store, online, through a commercial, through a pop-up, my experience should be the same. I should be satisfied with Bath and Body Works products and services regardless of where I come in contact with their brand. So seamless just means that my experience should be the same regardless of when I come in contact with that brand. All right, so new stuff today. Remember your marketing campaigns are due today. We're gonna to present those tomorrow and vote. So remember to get those in. All right, so today we're, used, we're looking at how technology is used in customer relationship management. So we watched a couple of videos, but I'm not gonna show those on here. Um, all right, so this is a picture of how technology is used, a database is used to manage customer information. So you've got your customer interactions at the top through advertising, email, direct mail, their website, personal in interaction face-to-face -face or on the phone, and then of course, if they're calling in for customer service. It goes into your CRM database, and then from there, they can see what your customers thought, um, what is the relationship like, and then actually do some productivity with trying to get customers to continue to buy their product through marketing and sales, operations of the business, and then also helping customers out. So with your technology, what are the differences between customer relationship management technology and customer relationship management? It's just one basic distinct difference. One is the actual relationship that you have with your customer and the other one is just the software that's used to organize and actually communicate with those customers. So companies of all sizes try to make the best use of the data that they have collected about their customers by using an automated database and database management tools. So um, what these automated databases do they will automatically send out texts to the customers. They'll automatically send out phone calls to the customers. If you're on a, um, a, a company's website, they'll automatically send you those little pop-ups on the screen to see if you want to talk to a customer service rep. So these automated databases are taking the place of those face-to-face -face or on the phone direct communications with those customers. So it saves these companies a lot of time when a computer can actually make the initial contact with a customer and then if the customer wants to actually speak to a representative, they can go into more depth with that system. So an automated database just does those automated um, emails, text, phone calls, pop-ups, instead of a person actually initiating that contact. So custom CRM solutions help helps businesses achieve the goal of just automating that, that primary contact leading to improved customer service and hopefully increasing sales and increasing profits for the company. So they can reduce the people that they hire because they've got a database system that's automatically contacting those customers. So <clears throat> this, this data that is being collected by this software system is customer contact information, their purchase history, so what transactions are they making, their demographics, so their income, whether they're married, their location, how much, um, like where they're working. Um, it also gathers <clears throat> service issues, open inquiries, questions that customers have, sales opportunities, who, what customers we need to call and when, and even marketing campaigns can be managed by the software, which is really cool, like pop-up ads. So you can create a pop-up ad through digital design software and then upload that into your CRM system and then that pop-up ad is automatically sent to your customers at a certain time period. All that stuff can be programmed, which is so cool. So a person that actually have to send a customer a pop-up ad, it's automated. So this gives you better customer service, a better insight of relationships with your customers and prospects, future customers, and better lead management and finally, hopefully more closed deals. And that's what we cover for today. Yeah, make sure to go into Canvas, do your exit ticket. If you were finished with your marketing campaign, I'll let you leave class early. Um, if you were not, then we just kind of hung out in class together and worked to finish these. I'll see y'all tomorrow for presentations.